are the window to the soul. Oh my god. Look at that, how on earth did they do that? Olá pessoal, bem-vindos a mais um vídeo nesse canal. Nós somos cidadãos do terceiro mundo e nesse vídeo a gente reage e aprende sobre o primeiro mundo. Nesse vídeo a gente vai reagir a Estou em um hotel de gelo na Suécia. Então pedimos que por favor você se inscreva, ative as notificações e também faça mais sugestões aqui embaixo nos comentários. E agora vamos para a reação. Hi everyone, welcome back. So today I'm 20 kilometers north of the Arctic Circle, just outside Karina is the original céu. ice hotel, and I'm going to be spending a night here. What's it like? Let's go find out. Okay, let's head in and find my room. Nossa, the temperature um out here is what telo. minus 13 degrees. What's interesting is my room is a lot warmer, but only just at minus two, I think. Wow. wow. Straight away as you walk in, look at the ceiling, it's all glittering and everything. Olha como brilha o teto. Look at these works of art, amazing. Welcome to Tawny Land. I've got a chandelier here, completely made out of ice. Look at the reflection on the floor. Wow. That is pretty special. So the ice bar is just there. I'll get myself a drink in a minute. Meu Deus, como é que eles conseguiram fazer uma escada? So you can get a bit more of a, a better view of the ice bar. And obviously through here, I think people are sitting down enjoying a drink. Incrível. This is crazy. It's all so smooth. So my room is down there. Before I go, I'm gonna get a drink. Hopefully it'll send me to sleep. Which is your best seller? Uh, Northern Lights. I'll go for Northern Lights then, please. Look at that, in the ice. It's amazing. And even the bar behind it is all made out of ice that the drinks are standing on. Do you get cold working in here? Não, não está tão bem, não é? Interessante a roupa desse moço que trabalha aí, porque a impressão que eu tenho é que parece que ele não está com tanta roupa. Como isso é possível? Olha, isso realmente é, um, é um, uma pergunta de difícil... E, 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 e é uma pergunta muito difícil de ser dada uma resposta, porque a gente que mora num país onde a maior parte do tempo é o calor... Realmente eu não consigo imaginar o tipo de roupa que eles possa estar trajando nesse lugar frio. E me impressiona muito a construção desse lugar. Não, isso é, isso é louco, muito louco, meu Deus. The colors are going to be very similar to what the colors are of the Northern Lights. Exactly. You can see through the bar. Look at that. <laughs> meu Deus. Thank you. Oh, God. Agora que eu percebi que o copo é de gelo. I need a glove. Just look at that. Ah, oh, so this is where you do ice sculpting. Caramba. I am going to try that. Looks like a Ferris wheel. You know you go in some ice bars and you need gloves because the ice is melting in your hands and it kind of slips away, but... How do I drink it? The corners are just so sharp. I can't drink... You can't drink it gracefully. Wow. <laughs> Hopefully that'll send me to sleep tonight. I really love the theming in here as well. It's like theming of a fun fair. Tawnyland. Cheers. I feel like if I could serve it to somebody else, I'd just do that. It would work. Just realize what this is. This is a roller coaster. And look at that. So there's two ice hotels here. The... Eu acho muito interessante esse lugar porque para as pessoas que apreciam degustar uma boa bebida é ótimo, porque você não pode demorar muito para beber, senão o copo descongela. Então eu creio que para as pessoas que gostam de apreciar a bebida, deve ser ótimo. Porque é, tem que beber muito rápido, senão o copo vai descongelar. Meu Deus, é incrível. Eu me pergunto como conseguiram construir isso. Porque é um lugar como outro qualquer, só que é um lugar de gelo. Isso é muito doido. Regional Ice Hotel, which is where I'm staying, and the Ice Hotel that gets rebuilt every year. We'll have a look around there later. But first, let's go and check out my room. I've got my room key. I think a lot of people are already in their rooms. Come on, let's go. So I'm in room number 
3.03. Oh, this is an art suite, so it's not just a basic room. Dreaming in a dream. Deluxe suite, so I do get a warm bathroom. And these are the artists that created it. I have no idea what's behind this door. The door's leather. Oh my God. Is this my, this is my room? The door's shut. What's that noise? I think there's these sensors that make it go off. Yeah, they are. Look, one above the door. That is crazy. So, oh my God, if there is a ghost in here that walks past in the middle of the night, that'll set that off. I'm going crazy. Is that like a, is that like a face in there? Look at the artwork in here. So I've got myself a table some seats and whatever that is. I wonder if actually anyone sits around here. Now breakfast is included, but it's not here. It's in a restaurant that's literally out of here and down the road. I do get some juice in the morning, some very warm juice to warm me up. But yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be spending too much time around this table. God, that is so cold. Look at the eyes, how green the eyes are. I wonder how they did that. Absolutely amazing. That kind of freaks me out a little bit. There's a bench there. Eu falei que isso vai ser um castelo, mas agora eu tô achando esse lugar parecendo aqueles lugares ultra secretos que a gente vê em filme e ficam bem protegidos e poucos têm acesso, porque meu Deus, uma coisa dessa é muito surreal, é inacreditável isso. Realmente, é surpreendente e eu fico imaginando o trabalho que deve ter dado para ter realizado esse lugar. Porque são muitas esculturas e, e você tem que reproduzir mesas, cadeiras, bancadas de, de bar, é, estantes para colocar as bebidas. Realmente deve, deve dar muito trabalho fazer esse lugar. O que eu acho muito louco é que isso no inverno, né, tudo bem, mas... E no verão, isso não derrete. Eu não, eu, eu posso estar enganado, mas eu tive a impressão de, de ter ouvido ele mencionar que é reconstruído esse lugar. Hum, meu eu Deus, posso então estar enganado. é um trabalho muito duro, né? Sim, eu posso estar enganado. Se você souber, deixa aqui nos comentários para confirmar essa informação. In something near the door. I'm assuming that my bedroom is beyond this wall, so I don't know which way do we go. Let's go. This way. Is this a tree? Yeah, it's like a tree, isn't it? I hope that sound doesn't go off all night. All right, let's go. Wow. And here is my bed that I'm going to be sleeping ah. on tonight in this ice room. This is crazy. Interesting design on the headboard. For a second, I had to do a, a double take. But look at this. Those little lights and the, incrível, the red incrível. eye on the lizard. Detalhe, so beyond that room is my bathroom and shower. I've paid extra to obviously get one of these rooms. Otherwise, you'd have to go to the toilet down the corridor. Look at all this blue ice. And look at the ceiling. Wow. I can't believe this is all for me. So the bed is literally on a bed of ice. And then there's a, there's a mattress Caramba. on top of the ice, some reindeer husk as well, so you don't get overly cold, and some pillows. Let's do the bed test, shall we? Oh, the mattress actually is quite comfy. I think it will hopefully be even more comfy when I'm in a sleeping bag and some thermal underwear. But at the minute, yeah. This is quite comfy. Honestly, é the best que thing about this room is this lizard. Lá All right, it's going to sound weird to say this, but it's not overly that cold in here. The temperature is probably around about minus two. Considering outside it's minus 13, this feels positively balmy. Right, Caramba. let's get ready for bed. Before I do that, though, I'm going to check out my bathroom and maybe take a nice hot bath to warm me up. Let's go. So, 
I have to make sure that that door is shut before I head in to the bathroom. Temperature in here compared to outside is warming up a little bit. I wow. think it's 13 degrees. Let's see what we got. Wow. This is one big bathroom. It's also really warm. I don't know what the temperature must be. 23 degrees, degrees actually. I think when it comes to going to bed, it's going to be tough to get out of here because I'm going to take a nice hot bath before I get into bed because I think that will get me warm and keep me warm, hopefully. So, realmente seria bem interessante se todo o banheiro fosse de gelo. Eu fico imaginando que em alguns momentos no uso do banheiro poderia ser bem desconfortável. Meu Deus, esse lugar é incrível. É incrível, porque você vê que ele fala que aí tá até mais quente, né? Do que lá fora. Mas isso é loucura, a pessoa tá dentro de um lugar de gelo. Meu Deus. É incrível. Eu... A huge bath. Look at that. That is absolutely massive. Complimentary shower gel. And also a huge rainfall shower. Um so that'll be nice. Luxuoso. I'll have a bath tonight and then the rainfall shower in the morning. But this also comes with its very own sauna. Wow. Nice. Looking Realmente forward to trying é that later. Luxuoso. Obviously got a sink, some towels, a huge mirror with that light going around the edge. So I've got some towels, a hair dryer, some information, stuff where I can hang my clothes. So I can relax in here if I want, because I've got a couple of seats. Ooh, kettle. And I've got some hot chocolate, coffee, milk, tea, sugar, and a couple of cups as well. Probably not a good idea to actually take that into the ice room. But there is another door, and that is, which is the bathroom. Wow. wow, is that? That's wood. That is completely and utterly made, yeah, out of wood. Look at that. So it's interesting they've got a sink here where the toilet is. And also a sink out here. And if I wasn't paying attention earlier, how to survive and sleep well in a room made of snow and ice. Well, there you go. That is the bathroom. So here's my bag with all my goodies in that I need. So let's find out what's in here. Something for the head. Something for your phone, I think. The inner, oh, there's two. The inner warmer blanket. I think there's two of these. My sleeping bag. And another sleeping bag. Obviously, they thought there must be two people staying here tonight. I hope you don't think it's a cop out. But this is a heated jacket, and I can turn this temperature up. I might use that tonight as well. All right, let's get to bed. Caramba. All right, before I get to bed, I'm going to get in this bath, which I'm assuming is going to take a long time to fill up. Yeah, that might take a while. That'll do. Took about five minutes to fill. And a nice cup of tea and a hot bath before bed. Cheers. I'll tell you what, there is one thing I can't forget, and that's this key. Because if I do, I can't get back in the warm room and I'd have to go all the way to reception like this. So, best not forget that. Almost forgot my bedding. Meu Deus, right. que lugar louco. Let's to bed. So I've got a pillow, but I'm not supposed to put this pillow in here. I'm just supposed to put the sleeping bag on it and get wrapped up inside there. Give me a couple minutes, let me get cozy. Even though this is quite thin, this blue cloth, it uh, is well nice and warm. Now obviously I've got to keep my phone either in one of those bags or in my sleeping bag. I hope I don't need the, the toilet in the night. Well, I'm in. I've got a light switch down there. I'm going to turn it off and I'll see you in the morning. No night. Gente, eu tô chocada porque ele falou que ele falou a temperatura e eu não tô conseguindo assim associar essa temperatura com o lugar, porque 
Me parece que é muito mais frio. Você olha e você acha que é muito mais frio. E na verdade não é. Isso está me deixando doida. Isso é... Meu Deus. Realmente, porque... Do lado de fora, parece que está fazendo mais frio do que dentro desse hotel de gelo. O hotel de gelo já é um lugar frio. Porém, o banheiro, por exemplo, parece que não está tendo... Não, não, não tem essa temperatura. É mais quente. Então, são diversos graus de temperatura variados, muito bem controlados dentro do hotel. É incrível. Uau. É incrível. Tudo que eles fizeram aí é muito incrível. Oh, my God. God, it's dark. Oh, that was an interesting night's sleep, to say the least. Well, I did sleep, but um, it took me ages. I was tossing and turning, first of all, to get comfortable, because when you're restricted in a sleeping bag, you know, I like to sleep with my arms all over the place, pretty much. The sleeping bag... It's really warm and it's really cozy. I'm gonna shuffle into the bathroom. Well, let's go. I think I might be the first one up. God. Meu Deus. No one's in the ice bar this morning. No one person is. Well, that was cold. In fact, it feels warmer out here. Did I sleep in the ice hotel? The answer to the question is, yeah, I did. I didn't sleep a whole eight hours. I kept waking up. It was nice and warm. It was nice and warm in that sleeping bag. There were a few parts where I got a little bit cold, but also I woke up really hot as well. I think when the sleeping bag kind of really came over my head and also my mouth, which they say you should do that because then it will get cold and damp in the sleeping bag. I did, however, like the fact that I paid that little bit extra to have the bathroom because especially in the middle of the night, if I did need to get to the toilet, it wouldn't have been that much of a long journey, which I didn't need to do, thankfully. But getting up this morning and having a nice hot bath and a cup of tea, that was really good. I just wanted to show you some of these rooms. These completely get rebuilt every single year. Look at the chandelier. Thank you. It's amazing. Wow. What's this, like a church? Nossa, é antigo. This room is crazy. Standing here at the altar. So in here you've got basic accommodation down there and there's some art suites down here which I'll show you as well. So these are completely customary, get rebuilt every year. This is called High Score and as you can probably imagine it's to do with computer games. Look at this. Caramba, isso é loucura. How cool is this room? Meu I love Deus. how the LED lights are changing over there. Like Tetris Man, or is that Minecraft? Not quite sure. That is brilliant. Love this room. Até os detalhes, Now, é tudo, popular tudo é perfeito. Eu Meu posso Deus. estar enganado, mas a impressão que eu tenho é que são, parecem ser quartos temáticos. Sim, eu também acho. Uau! Que viu? O trabalho que eles colocaram nisso é uma coisa fascinante. Cada detalhe você vê realmente que houve muita dedicação. É, é um lugar incrível. Realmente, é um lugar impressionante. I think this is my favorite in the whole entire ice hotel. Olha it's isso. called Mushrooms. And they've all got LED lights in them. Look at this. Wow. Look at those ridges in it. And you've got these two huge snails. But again, look at this. Each of these have been carved. Now I've tried ice sculpting it's and it's done. blooming difficult. So seriously, The people that do all this definitely have a skill. Com certeza. Wow, look at this room. 
you've got the sun up there in the clouds and a waterfall and then the bed look at the chairs and tables look at that wow now this room is different because it's a room within a room a bit like the crystal maze the bed in here is in this dome or igloo look at that so you think to yourself is it even colder because it's in an ice room within an ice room that sleeps up to three people crazy and by the way if you're wondering how quiet it is in here just listen the snow acts as brilliant soundproofing in each individual room so if you fancy staying in the ice it's hotel you. and you don't want to go for one of the expensive rooms the cheaper rooms are up here and i'll show you what i mean by cheaper rooms they are kind of no frills but you're still staying in an ice hotel so it's basic rooms no art just the the bed on ice Mas é fascinante. Isso, I mean, it's decorated a little bit on the walls but they are pretty standard compared to what i've seen recently you know all this ice has come from the the river next to us and it's harvested every year so next year's ice hotel will be harvested in the spring all be ready for next year and all this will completely melt away they just leave it awesome. so these are just the the basic stand rooms tipo tudo derrete e eles vão ter que reconstruir então que trabalho incrível né porque eles sabem que isso tudo depois vai por água abaixo é, sem dúvidas. Eu imagino todo ano ter o trabalho para poder levantar e estruturar esse hotel com todas essas esculturas. Realmente tem que ter muita dedicação para isso. É verdade, até porque tudo é muito bem feito, né? Não são só paredes lisas, são praticamente... Tudo com detalhe, tu, todas as paredes têm detalhes. É, incrível, incrível. Three people on the bed in this one. And the question you're asking is, what do you do if you stay in this part and you need to go to the toilet? The toilet, that's this one you see, is out here. So, if it's snowing like it is at the minute, you literally have to come out here to use the bathroom. So, it's, a, it's very warm, so you've got the, the toilet just there. So you've got your lockers where you can store all your stuff. Wow. And they're all warm as well. Wow. Look yeah. at that. Now, that is what you call a bed and headboard made out of ice. That's insane. Some esculturas. And look at these seats. Some reindeer husks there to keep your bum warm the ice are the window to the soul oh my god look at that how on earth did they do that that is crazy this guy's got his arm coming out of the ice back into the ice and back out again wow now that is amazing a woman cased in ice crazy this one is called sauna Oh right, so they've replicated like a sauna. I guess that would be kind of like a bathtub. Look at this. <laughs> you can sunbathe. I don't know if you can see that, but that actually looks like a dressing gown, but it's it's ice. Eu tô realmente impressionado com essa estrutura que foi criada, a dedicação, todos os detalhes, veja essas paredes. Olha o detalhe que essas paredes possuem. Tudo é muito bem feito. Incrível. É verdade, é impressionante, porque para mim esse hotel de gelo é uma verdadeira obra de arte. Ele por inteiro, porque para você fazer isso você tem que ser um artista. Aqui, isso que a gente está vendo é pura arte, é uma coisa incrível. Eles têm uma sensibilidade incrível para fazer tudo isso. É uma coisa perfeita. Here's the bed. Look, snowballs. 
You've got snowballs in the room, although these are ice balls, I wouldn't want to throw them. The attention to detail is absolutely crazy. I mean, look at that. Again, these are not towels. This is solid ice. Now this room is just like Superman and where he lives. But the most impressive thing about this room, for me, is the chandeliers. Because just look how they've done them. And I think the way they've done this is obviously they've put all wow. this wire up and then they've sprayed and then that's frozen, sprayed again and keep going until you get what you see here, which is absolutely incredible. Because that and there's two either side there. I want to say a massive thank you to the ISO Tough for giving me a big discount actually on my stay. The details are in the description if you do fancy coming here. And if you fancy seeing more quirky hotels, how about staying the night in a luxury prison? Click the video here. Give the video a thumbs up. Hit subscribe. I'll see you next time. Meu Deus! Eu não tenho palavras para isso que a gente acabou de ver, porque que fascinante. Cada dia mais a gente aprende, descobre coisas na Suécia. Esse é mais um lugar agora que a gente precisa ir lá. Nem que seja para ir lá e tomar alguma coisa, mas eu preciso ir nesse lugar. Isso não, não é real, eu, eu não acredito nisso que eu acabei de ver. E isso é insano, insano demais para mim. Concordo plenamente. Para gente que não tem o costume de, de ter essa sensação térmica, desse frio intenso, como faz na Suécia e em outros países da Europa, realmente é impressionante. Mas o, o que mais chama realmente a minha, te, a, a minha atenção é a dedicação para estar tá criando, construindo essa estrutura muito bem detalhada, com, ó, com, repleta de obras de arte, porque realmente são obras de arte, é incrível. É realmente impressionante. Eu não poderia imaginar que existisse um lugar assim na Suécia. Não na é verdade, verdade, eu não imaginava que existia um lugar assim no mundo. E na Suécia é incrível. É incrível. A gente já tinha visto, acho que um, um trecho de algum vídeo que mostrava um pouco desse hotel. Mas olhando assim, é muito mais insano, né? É uma coisa completamente insana. Sem dúvidas. Mas essa é a reação desse vídeo. Portanto, aproveite a oportunidade, considere se inscrever no nosso canal, clique no gostei, compartilhe esse vídeo e faça mais sugestões nos comentários. Muito obrigada por assistir esse vídeo e nos vemos na próxima reação. Tchau! Tchau.